descending the East Bluff Trail. And someone at uh, Cave of the Mounds told me about how the rocks are like purplish here. Uh, I couldn't tell you why. If you know why, leave a comment. Why are the rocks at Devil's Lake purple? But it's cool because the streets and the highways are lined with uh, this purple tinted rock. Um, so that's a little bit special and different. Oh yeah. I actually overshot this part of the trail because uh, there comes a intersection where you can keep going east. Uh, I did not want to do that. That was going to be an extra mile out and mile back. Uh, so keep your eyes peeled when you're trying to transition at the south shore of Devil's Lake. Steep descent. I finally made it down uh, that massive uh, cliff of rocks. I'm tired. I had to sit down, eat some trail mix. It was a lot. I'm not used to the uh, ascending and descending with all the prairie hikes that I've been doing. Anyways, I'm at the south end of Devil's Lake. This rock right here, I'm pretty sure, is called Balanced Rock. It's one of the highlights of their trail maps. <clears throat> okay, crazy thing going on is when I was descending down, uh, these two guys were setting up ropes to climb uh, the side of that cliff. And I'm just like, that is next level. And that's the thing is, as I level up in my hiking, I'm going to meet other people, uh, other experts of the outdoors and... Um, people who are just super athletic and uh, I guess I had forgotten to expect that um, that there's always a next level um, and to keep pushing yourself so it was cool to be reminded that there are people out here climbing uh, the, the sides of cliffs all right I'm gonna carry on